Doctor Who. Beloved character. Every, everyone likes Doctor Who. Okay, that's really good. Okay, let's let's keep scrolling. Okay. Magics, and I'm assuming Magic the Gathering, 2023 sets will wrap up with Frexian War, Welcome Gandalf, and Doctor Who. This is why I don't play Magic anymore. Okay? Because I can't have... Chun Li from Street Fighter fighting Doctor Who and Gandalf. Okay. All right. Could you stop? Wizards of the Coast, you are fucking up everything you touch. All right. You have the Midas touch, but your fingers are covered in shit. Okay. You're just getting those little shit prints over everything. It's just sticky, brown, and smells like crap. Okay, stop messing with what you have that worked. Okay, your open GL, your freaking D and D nonsense that you're doing with the OGL 1.1, the endless crossover. There are freaking transformers in Magic: The Gathering now. You know what they're gathering? Other franchises' monies and fans because they're like, hey, you like Transformers? That'll cost you. Hey, you like Gandalf? That'll cost you. You like Doctor Who? Hey, Whovians! You ever play that game, Magic the Gathering? Bro, these are going to be fly-by-night casual people who aren't going to get into the game. It ain't going to happen. You think you're going to drag in all these new people with Transformers or Street Fighter, Doctor Who, or freaking Gandalf? Bro, <sighs> God, like Wizards of the Coast, you are just so far off of what you think you need in your franchise. It's ridiculous. You know, there is something to be said. Oh, you don't want your franchises going stagnant. I get that. Fresh coat of paint. We went over that with the Scooby-Doo Velma thing. However, it's got to make sense. It's got to make sense. Transformers, Street Fighter, Doctor Who, and Gandalf do not need to be in Magic the Gathering, okay? Gandalf is a slight maybe, okay? Wizards, hobbits, dwarves, all that, fine. I'll let that pass. I will let that pass. You want to throw Lord of the Rings in there? Beautiful, okay? I'm fine with it. I'll, okay. Transformers? Bro. Transformers. Transformers. Sure you don't want to get Ricky and Morty in there? Why not? You want to have a Fortnite event in your Magic the Gathering game? Do you even care about your content anymore? Clowns. Yo, just flat out, stop, stop making product, okay? Wizards of the Coast, stop making product. Just stop. Take a hiatus. God. And then you'll wonder why they're trying to monetize their fan base through OpenGL 1.1, you know? Dude, OGL 1.1, this way we can make a little bit of money from that fan. The fans are doing it better than you. That's the problem. Your talent apparently is bereft of any because you're... Hey, let's put Doctor Who in there. You want Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles too? The Simpsons? How about Iron Man? You know? Clowns. Utter clowns, man. In my humble opinion, this is not for me. You know, it worked with the, the what? The Wise Schwarz thing. Because it's an anime card game that just basically has anime characters. Fine. Like, whew, okay. It's not really set in a particular thing. It's just anime characters. Anime character card game. Okay, throw everybody in there. It doesn't matter. You know what? It doesn't matter. You want to have Attack on Titan with uh, Rent-A-Girlfriend? Fine. Okay. They can fight it out in a parking lot. Don't care, you know? But it it's Magic the Gathering is that wizard magic, you know, gnomes, goblin kind of world. It is, for lack of a better term, a Middle Earth kind of vibe. When you start throwing Cybertron into Middle Earth, it gets stupid. It gets stupid. You know, I'm so tired of companies di diluting their franchises just for the ca cash grab. You know, 